The winds of change breezed over Namibia when three of the most prominent sectors of the country entered into an open and honest dialogue for a better future for citizens of the land of the brave. More than 300 members of the business and farming communities turned up at this historic event to hear from the Prime Minister what the future holds for them. Gainko pledged that government will remain committed to maintaining peace and stability in the country. We have to think of those who are not doing very well. We have peace, but if we don't address the social deficits that we still have in this country, where some are still poor, nowhere to sleep, no food to eat, even in big cities like we do, then we might think of those of us who are privileged. What do we do to think of those who are not having it so that we can maintain our peace? Trusco Group Managing Director Quentin van Rooyen described the event as historic, adding that he experienced a new, fresh breath of communication, cooperation and a feeling that no party will see one another as an enemy anymore. He says that Namibians are privileged to get a president who wants nobody to feel left out. He is saying, let us take hands, let us take hands to make this beautiful country of us a place for everyone to live in, a place that grows economically, a place that the marginalized is not left behind and not overseen. 